Hey everyone, it's your buddy Crypto Profit back with another video, and today we're going to be taking a quick look at Anchor. So if you guys are Anchor holders, make sure to quickly subscribe to the channel, turn notifications on, and like the video as we do daily updates on Anchor, as well as so many other altcoins that are near and dear to our hearts. So we do see that $1.1 billion market cap. In the last 24 hours, we saw a $119.9 million in the last 24 hours. That is a fairly substantial amount for something just at that $1.1 billion mark. I will say, guys, link looking at Anchor recently, I do think we we are getting new and new investors really to start to look into what Anchor is as well as starting to invest. So we're going to kind of take a look at that recently with this last 24 hour span being only a 1% decrease. A lot of coins doing much, much worse in the market so far today. So we're actually seeing Anchor recover fairly well from this dip down to about 13.5 cents, May 10th, about 4.05 p.m., where every other coin did dip as well. Anchor didn't dip near as hard and it recovered just as fast. So I will say Anchor is one of those coins that is looking very good for for the future of May, June, and 2021. So we will be doing price predictions for May, June, and 2021. So stick around for that at the end of the video. But let's jump into what Anchor is and some of the most recent news and information that we want to get out to you guys uh, as soon as possible. So Anchor is an Ethereum token that powers Anchor, a Web3 infrastructure and cross-chain staking DeFi platform that aims to make it easy and affordable for anyone to participate in blockchain ecosystems by building dApps, hosting nodes, or staking. The Anchor token can be used to pay for services on the Anchor platform, such as node deployment and as uh, you know, API services. So participate in on-chain governance and also act as an insur uh, insurance for network participants. So now that we're through what Anchor is, we're going to go into more details on why it's so important to understand what Anchor is uh, and really truly what everything we see about Anchor coming up could actually push Anchor to higher points in uh, the very few weeks or months ahead. Uh, if we take a look at the last month, we do still see about an even uh, 0.31% increase. So nothing sub substantial at all. I do think, you know, we've been at this trend for a while now, and I think it is about time to break loose. So we're going to talk about that here in a second. Jumping into our first article of today, it's going to be uh, the anchor update. So this was actually back in April 30th, but we haven't really talked about these partnerships as much as I would like. So anchor and Vite Labs, a fearless high performance public chain and the world's first DAG based smart contract platform, well suited for commercial D apps with performance. We also have the Moonbeam Network, a cross chain smart contract platform for Polkadot. These are two huge partnerships and not really, uh, they didn't get enough, you know, I guess attention in my opinion. I don't think a lot of people realized how big these were. We're not going to dive too deep into these partnerships today just because we would be here for quite some time. But if we go back to each of these tweets, it'll, uh, I think one's a tweet. Yeah, this one brought us to a tweet. This one didn't bring us to a tweet. This one brought us to the Moonbeam network itself. It talks about this partnership in whole and how it's such a big deal uh, and what it's really going to do for Anchor. So we also have that over here with Vite Labs. So thanks to the partnership, the Anchor token, we will easily transferable uh, cross chain and there will be a temporary increase in the market making as mining rewards 10x for anchor btc trading pair so like i said this is obviously a good deal uh getting two new uh partnerships in april but we're going to talk about march now so or i guess may sorry not march we're not going to go backwards even more uh we're going to go into may so now first tweet we want to take a look at is this came out may 9th they always do a daily uh or not daily sorry weekly update on sunday so this sunday they had a uh, basically a tweet talking about this week's been a little slower on the front, but strong behind the scenes. We are working on fixing the capacity issue. As we speak, we launched the bi-weekly newsletter. We started daily threads on Reddit. We are on Keiko talk. I'm not sure exactly how to say it. We are also hiring. So they've been hiring for forever now, it seems. So it's obviously a good thing to continue to see that they are doing, they're doing so well. They have so many big plans that they need new and more people. Uh, we also see, you know, big things just like talking and being transparent on Reddit, uh, you know, bi-weekly newsletters. And obviously this is a big deal as well. The Keiko talk, and we talk about, you know, fixing the capacity issue as we speak. So that's a big deal. Obviously a lot of people understanding that, you know, anchor is on the right path. We've been trending fairly well for a while, uh, you know, just stabilizing for the most part. Um, and they know that too, that this week has been slower. So they talk about how it's been slower and we haven't gotten much new information, but the strong behind the scenes is a big deal. Obviously seeing uh, a few things that are probably in the works and where they're getting closer and closer on announcing something or giving us any new information. Uh, so like I said, guys, we had two big partnerships last month. What do we think is coming in the future? We haven't seen anything too big yet. So I do think in the upcoming days and weeks, we are going to see some good partnerships, hopefully start to kickstart our anchor push to, uh, you know, very big all-time high pushes this month and next month. So let's take a look at the next thing. So anchor bulls, they always talk about anchor quite a lot. So if you guys want to follow them and uh, get your daily information on anchor, you definitely can do so. It uh, looks like they're followed by Anchor as well. So it says the gates are open, number one app at Coinbase and new investors flooding in buying Anchor. So you can actually see here that Coinbase is number one in the top charts of free apps. 
beating out Robinhood, thankfully. Um, just a lot of people are starting to invest, and I understand that Anchor is one of those very easy to invest in on Coinbase, and I think that's really going to start to flood you know, with new investors seeing this price point of $0.15 cents and seeing what Anchor is really capable of. Obviously, the utility behind Anchor is fantastic. I do think there's going to be a strong future ahead for Anchor holders. Jumping into our last uh, tweet of today, we're going to just take a look at this chart here. So you guys know I don't do technical analysis on the actual videos themselves. However, I usually do technical technical analysis before I make the actual, uh, you know, these actual videos for price predictions, as well as, um, you know, I do them sometimes on videos, but not too much. I never use the actual uh, the trading view that most people would like to see if they are uh, a little bit more advanced traders. But I understand my audience mostly just new traders looking into for price predictions and news. So that's exactly what I do. So about to pull the trigger on Anchor, 100 plus days of insane support. So that's exactly what you're seeing here is great support behind Anchor's push up. Uh, we saw it actually rise above this 15.7 cent mark and we are continuing to see, you know, a very large future with great support. I think Anchor will continue on this run. This bull market, this bull run itself is going to be great for altcoins as a whole and Anchor is definitely an altcoin that's going to do fairly well in this bull run. If we take a look at the last year alone, I I'd say the last month actually is going to be what we're going to look at. Uh, you can see that, you know, there has been pretty much substantial uh, stabilization for the most part. We saw it dip down to about 10 cents. Uh, but for the most part, if you take a look at the last year alone, we saw a massive increase. We saw it go to about 22.5 cents, kind of decreased and stabilized ever since, uh, which is good. We held that large increase from 7 cents. We have never went down to, you know, 7 cents again. Um, so it's showing that we've stabilized out. Uh, obviously, you know, we we did bottom out at about 10 cents, I believe. I think I just said that. Um, yeah, so 10 cents, April 22nd, 10 p.m. when the whole market dipped. But for the most part, you know, Anchor's doing a great job of stabilizing above this increase, or I guess right after this increase. So I do think we are going to continue to see a sideways trend for a little bit longer. And I do think with some big news or some big partnerships coming out, I think that will start the, the push for Anchor that's really needed to push it farther and farther. We saw it on this chart here. Uh, it does a pretty good job of showing exactly what we're seeing here. So pretty great support. We saw it go down to about 15.7. Uh, the support is going to be fairly good for us pushing forward. Obviously, this was back May 4th, so things have changed since then. Uh, but for the most part, I think there is still a lot of support there. And I think for the most part, we are going to see some good increases coming within the next week or even month ahead. So let's take a look at our price predictions now. Jump back to that price chart. Let's give it a quick refresh. Make sure we still have the most recent up-to-date price. Looks like a still stable 0.01% decrease, but fairly, fairly stable. So right around 15 cents right now. I do think pushing forward by the end of May, we could easily see Anchor pushing its way closer to a 20 cent price point. A lot of people hoping for a lot more. I honestly don't think you know, Anchor is going to push much higher than about 20.65 cents that we saw April 16th. That's what we're on pace for. That's what we're on target for. I do think that's going to happen. Um, you know, 20 to 22 cents right around our previous all-time high is a cape, or I guess a possibility by the end of May. If we can get above 20 cents, that should be, a, you know, a good profit margin for a lot of people. A lot of people should be happy with that kind of an increase. 20 to 22 cents is what I would suggest for a price target for the end of May. Going into the end of June, that's where I think we will definitely reach past our previous all-time high of that 22.52 cents. I think we'll push almost to 30 cents. I think it'll be right on the edge of 30 cents. That's definitely a price target for us to reach to that 30 cents. But like I said, about 28, 29 cents is where I think Anchor is going to end up by the end of June. Do remember, guys, these are very conservative price predictions. And remember, I am not a financial advisor. So always do your own research before investing as this is not financial advice. Jumping into our final our final price prediction, that's going to be 2021. So where do we think Anchor is going to end up by the end of 2021? Well, there's a bunch of different spots and we actually could see it doing much, much more than what I'm about to say because the market cap is almost below 1 billion, which is amazing, amazing. I think this 50 cent, 15 cent price point could easily jump its way to you know a dollar by the end of the year but realistically and conservatively i want to say 50 cents is my price target for anchor by the end of the year do remember guys like i said it could jump much higher than that this is a very um you know if things stay a little bit slower on anchor side i think 50 cents is a price target that we will still be capable of seeing and reaching so that is going to be my, my conservative price prediction let me know in the comments if you guys agree or disagree with my price predictions as well as if you guys think we're on the right path if we are you know going to stabilize out for a whole another month if it's going to take two months what do you guys think we're going to start pushing and how high do you think we're going to get to? Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Make sure to quickly subscribe to the channel, turn notifications on and like the video as well as jump into the description below and you can actually take advantage of those referral links. There's going to be a Voyager uh, referral link down there. I think that one helps us the most. It gives me $25 when you guys you know, deposit $100, you also get $25. So it helps us both. I would really appreciate it. Voyager is a pretty great 
um, you know, it's a pretty great uh, exchange to use. There's also Binance and uh, many others that will help you guys out. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. I'll see you guys all in the next one.